Hello everyone, I'm Teacher Joe from Blue Tree Education. Today, I will be sharing about experimental questions. How do we answer experimental questions? So before we begin, do like our PSLE discussion group on Facebook and do check out our Facebook page, Blue Tree Education. Shall we begin? Experimental questions are quite different from the usual science questions that you have done. So what are experimental questions? They are usually measurable, they may include a specific time frame, and also they have specific terminology, or what you call question words. Some of these question words may be familiar to you, for example, aim of the question, the conclusion, identify the variables. So the very first thing that you have to do is to identify these question words. What is the question asking for? So again, use your trusted stationery, the highlighters. Highlight the key question word and you're ready to start. Now, experimental questions always comes with a set of data or what you are always known as the results. It is very important to link the results to your final answer and that is the key strategy to obtaining full marks for that question. So how do you link the results to the experimental question? Remember earlier, I mentioned that it is important to highlight the key question term. Now, the step number two is to link the question term to the set of results and finally arriving to the final answer. And now, you have come to the final step. After you have identified the results and also find the key question term, now it is important to use the right answer structure for your experimental questions. So for example, if the question asks you about the aim of the experiment, you must use the answer structure to find out. And if the question is asking for a conclusion, then it is important to use the answer structure as Have you got it? Well done! I hope that you have found this video about experimental questions useful. If you like this video, do subscribe to our YouTube channel and do continue to follow us on Facebook for more science tips and revision guides. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye!